Let's cook today a delicious and hearty lunch for the whole family. For this, we will need chicken drumsticks. First, we need to season them with salt and add black pepper, paprika, and sunflower oil. Now mix everything well so that the spices are evenly distributed on the surface of the chicken drumsticks. You can now cover them with a lid and let them marinate. During this time, let's prepare the rice. First, rinse it several times until the water becomes clear. Then transfer the rice to a pot, add cold water, and cover the pot with a lid. Bring the rice to a boil, and once it starts boiling, simmer for five minutes on medium heat. During this time, the rice will absorb most of the water. Then remove the pot from the heat and put the rice into another container. And now let's prepare the vegetables for the rice. Take a sweet bell pepper and cut it into julienne strips. Also, mushrooms would be a great addition to this dish. You can cut them into two to four pieces depending on their size. Take a spacious container and put the rice into it. Then add the vegetables to the rice and mix them well. Pour generous amounts of heavy cream on top. Distribute it evenly throughout the container. Now the rice needs to be covered with chicken broth, but first add salt, black pepper, and turmeric to it. Pour the broth evenly over the dish, just like the cream. By this time, the chicken drumsticks should be well marinated. Now let's prepare them for baking. Take a wire rack from the oven and arrange the chicken drumsticks on the surface. It's easy to do this by spreading the rack's bars in the center. Distribute the chicken drumsticks on the rack so that they are directly above the container with rice. Preheat the oven at 180 degrees Celsius or 350 degrees Fahrenheit and cook for approximately 50 minutes. Meanwhile, you can prepare a salad. For this, you can use a mixed salad greens or iceberg lettuce. You'll need bell peppers, cucumbers, and cherry tomatoes as vegetables. Cut the bell peppers and cucumbers into medium-sized pieces. Cut the cherry tomatoes in half. You'll also need red onions. Cut them into quarter rings. And don't forget about olives. You can either slice them or leave them whole. And finally, let's prepare the salad dressing. Combine extra virgin olive oil, freshly squeezed lemon juice, salt, black pepper, and garlic. Mix everything together well. Add the dressing and gently toss the salad. Cut the feta cheese into small cubes and sprinkle it on top of the salad. Well, dinner is ready. Call the whole family to the table and enjoy your meal.